I have a, a question, and it's probably a very introspective question. You're such an approachable person. Your interaction with people in the moment is what adds value to them. Right. How? You know, man, it's perspective, you know? It's important that you, whoever you are, connect with me immediately yeah. or not. It's important that they take that away when they say, you know, I met Idris and, you know, I don't want ever to kind of get this feeling that people don't connect with me. Hopefully you'll take this moment, you're inspired by me, great, but you'll take that moment and inspire someone else or, you know, move forward with that. It's been such a different project. It's been a lot more involved. And I think that's partly to do, because we're making a commercial about me making a commercial. But what's happened with that is there's been real, a sort of a real sort of discovery within ourselves as artists mm. and, you know, it's been an amazing experience. And I know your heart's uh, very rooted in Africa and wanting to, yeah. to have a positive impact here. And uh, I think that's where the alignment of the brand comes in. Yeah, you know, Africa, you know, my parents are from Sierra Leone and Ghana. And there's a saying in Sierra Leone and culture is like, when you come to someone's house, don't come with your empty mm -hmm. hands, come with something. Mm -hmm. You know, I just think the opportunities between myself and the Odemeister brand and that, that house, um, I'll be able to bring something. I'm an actor, that's what I do, you know. But, you know, here we are making a commercial about essentially a drink, mm -hmm. you know. It's a very old drink, a drink that's been around for a long time. It's a famous drink. And I, I guess at the moment I'm the new face for that, mm -hmm. which is great. But also I feel like I'm almost sort of representing a new phase of, of you know, what Odemeister is about to do. How do we connect with a younger sort of demographic? Um, you know, it's a great drink, it's a great brand, people like it, people like to go out. I DJ, you know, I, I'm in this culture and I think it just fits because, you know, I, I, I also because I want to be in the clubs and DJ, but I also want to do outreach work, which is, you know, part of the brand's sort of legacy and what they want to do. If I can get an opportunity to bring someone new, someone young into the fold, uh, that, that makes me a lot, you know, very excited. And I'm just glad that, you know, the brand is about that, you know. Mm. That's what excites me about the future of this sort of union, actually. Mm. You know what I mean? You also dabble in a bit of technology. Uh, is, that's a, that's a little bit of a space for I'm you. I'm a geek. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah. am, I'm not going to lie, I'm a geek. Do you see that the future of, of everything is happening, like businesses and creativity, going more to the technology side? Africa is famous for the talking drum. This mm. is how we communicated a long time ago. One village spoke to another village via the drum. And in the future, people are speaking more and more via technology, period. You know, and for me, it's a space that always excited me. Um, you know, I know it's a space that's interesting to the brand. Yes. And that's, that's great because there's so many interesting ways we can collaborate on sort of ideas about that. And I'm only just understanding social media and how that can play a part in this whole technology thing. But... Um, yeah, I'm really excited about that. There are so many people that have amazing ideas and they either pursue it or they don't pursue it. Mm. But the world needs more people who pursue their ideas. Mm -hmm. If you could say one thing to those guys, what would it be? What would you say to them? Never get discouraged to a point that you want to stop. You have a role model and you meet them. Ask them a question. Get, you know, be encouraged by them. You know, if you have a moment to do something that's slightly outside of your comfort zone, do it, go for it. Seriously, because you know, and young people don't hear that enough. You know, you gotta go for it, you gotta really feel it.